My name is Stone Fleshman. I am here for my very first audition. Oh. <laughs> With Paula Abdul. Kidding me? <laughs> Who cares about three negative stars or whatever? I don't care if I got gold stars. I got to meet Paula Abdul. My dance was really good. Just shouldn't have tried to sing because the mic pack fell off and it was spinning around and screwed up my entire dance. But honestly, my dance wasn't that bad. I'll put it on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Not the messed up version. These people are nuts. Dancing is fun. Are you having fun with your, you know, tap dance? No, it's not fun. They're all like, she's right here. She kissed me. She kissed me like three or five times. Show me where she kissed you. She's right here. I went for the cheek, and she kissed her. It's been a long time since the woman's kissed me. <laughs> <laughs> I have a lip gloss on me. I have Paula Bill's lip gloss on me. <laughs> there you go. I'm making make a time to tell you you always always never number one without a doubt. And when when he is he is always on the show and I can go stay alone ever real life. <laughs> I kind of made up the words. <laughs> Dancing to me is just something I've always done in my bedroom, in the car. Um, I do it while I'm jogging. I just I mean I dance everywhere. Every time there's music playing I just dance. Um, I absolutely love it. It's it's for me to be free and for me to be myself. I think as a kid it helped me express my sexuality a lot and helped me come into who I am. Um, like Paula's music, and Paula's videos, and I mean, it just helped me grow up and helped me figure out who I really am. So music means so much to me, so much. I had no idea that I was ever going to be here or that I could even get this far. If I could ever, I mean, dance on a stage, a stage, period. I danced on a stage. Never mind that the stage had an audience. Never mind that there was lights and judges and Paula Abdul. Seriously? Amazing. I didn't answer your question. Uh, live to dance means, I mean, everything. I really do. I dance everywhere I am, no matter what. I'm a flight attendant. I dance on the aircraft all the time down the aisles. Uh, to me, living living to dance is that you breathe and you, you just you breathe dance. You you love it. You listen to music all the time. You just even if there's no music, you just dance. You want to dance all the time. And if I could, I would dance 24 hours a day. What do I love about Paula? Can I call her Paula now? Can I call her Paula Abdul. I. She's just, I mean, obviously she's an icon, blah, blah, blah. People are talking about, like nine-year-olds are talking about what an icon she is. They only know her from American Idol. No, she is, I mean, she started out, she was a you know, cheerleader dancing, and then she made an album, and she had, what, five, six number one hits? I mean, she, she made pop. She has made 80s, 90s pop dance. She represents the dance community. She was like the first major just dancer to become a pop star. So dancing was her passion. She was dance. Then she was, you know, singing. But dance was her thing, and I just, I always envied that about her. And always, always, of course, my dream when I was a kid was always to be a backup dancer for her, for the under the spell, under my spell tour. I remember entering the contest at MTV to name the tour. Can't remember what I tried to name it, but I do know that I wrote a letter to you, Paula. If she watches this, I wrote a letter to you, Paula. Paula, what did you say in Cold Hearted Snake? <laughs> just kidding. I, I know I didn't get to say, I, she just what an inspiration and just, I mean, seeing that she's just a dancer, she's a dancer at heart and that's what's inside her and that's what's inside me. I just don't have the, like I said, I don't have the talent. I just don't have, I just have, haven't had the opportunity like I did today before. So at 32 years old, I finally got the opportunity to do this and thank you so much, Paula, for giving me this opportunity.